Hey HD fans, welcome back. And for those new here, I'm Mark. I'm the editor-in-chief of the Scuba Diver magazine brand. And welcome to the Scuba Diver YouTube channel. We come to you once again from the beautiful Lahivani Atoll in the Maldives. We've moved islands. We are now on beautiful Kuredu with pro divers. We were on Horavali before. We paid a flying visit to Kudahu. There's also a commando, so you've got lots to choose from when you're out here. Now, before we left our last island, we did a fantastic night dive. You might have done one of these in the Caribbean or in the Indo-Pacific, somewhere else, but if you've never done one before, try it out. I'm talking fluoro night dives. Now, I have to admit, I'm not a big night dive fan. However, I will go out of my way to do one of these. Now, basically, on a night dive, you don't go very far. You tend to swim around with your torch, looking for the small critters that come out when the sun has gone down. With a fluoro night dive, you take things one step further. You basically get a light that you can either put a cover on or you get a special black light that puts out a UV light and you get a yellow filter that you have to wear over your normal diving mask. You can get the same filter to put over the end of your camera or your video camera, and then off you go to check out the underwater light. The difference using the filters is it brings out the most vibrant, fluorescent colors ever known when you shine your torch on them. I'm talking bright oranges, yellows, greens. It's phenomenal. It is like being in your own version of Avatar. It is so bright. It really is. You feel a little bit spaced out. Even if you're shallow, you could feel like you're a little bit narked. We found mores that glowed. Um, you've got anemones that are glowing but they're right next to a different anemone and it doesn't glow one sets it off one doesn't you can find little crabs that their antenna are glowing but the rest of the body doesn't shrimps their eyes glow it's just a really really surreal experience so if you are out here or anywhere that offers a fluoro night dive definitely try it out delay your nighttime apres dive beer until afterwards because it's well worth it now, since we got to Kuredu, we had to do their signature dive. Now, lots of places have their signature dives, but here, the Kuredu Express, it really is the dive you have to do. Now, the Maldives is known for channel diving. We obviously touched on that in one of our previous videos when we said about doing it using a scooter. Now, you can do the Express using a scooter. We did that this morning. But the way that they normally do it is the traditional way of diving a channel in the Maldives so you usually drop in up current and you drift down towards the corner where all the action happens and you then hook in with a reef hook into the corner get in position you're in a little train along the reef and then you just sit and wait and all the shoaling fish are there next year and once they get used to you the sharks come in next year on the shoulder and I have to say it is a bit bit weird just hanging there like this and then you've got a grey reef shark potentially sat two feet away from you unconcerned happily swimming into the current while you can take video photograph him just enjoy looking at the uh, at the critters that are next to you when you finish the dive and you're getting down lower on your air that's when the real fun happens because you basically release a reef hook and you just are fired like a cannon around the corner and you can go flying like superman around you still see the sharks and everything but it's just you see them at speed as you go around the corner so if you're on the island of Kuredu, definitely do the Kuredu Express. There are lots of other cool dives to do here as well, believe me, but make sure the Express is on your list at least once, if not twice. Now, if you enjoy what I'm doing, remember, hit that subscribe button, ring that notification bell, and we'll let you know when we've done any more videos. The next time you see us, we're going to be back home in the UK, in our studio. I don't think the weather's going to look quite the same as this, but we can't have everything. And remember, if you're going diving, stay safe and I'll catch you soon.